<sighs> so here we are again. And um, I don't know about you, but I've been wondering what on earth Elman Norton is up to these days? And the answer is, you know, not much, because when we're not playing with him, he can't actually do anything. So I felt bad. I felt bad for the fact that we've all been stuck in quarantine. I've been stuck in lockdown for like, oh, I feel like this is like week six because I started self-isolating before we officially had to. And I haven't once checked in on Elmer Norton and his family. Not once. I haven't checked in to see how they're doing. I don't know what's going on. I don't know if they're in quarantine. I don't know if COVID-19 has spread to whatever town I dumped them into. I just don't know. And I want to know. So today, me, you, and the Norton family are gonna get reacquainted. But not only that, we're gonna do it with the Desperados. Okay, so these are my other games. However, I want to load this game here with Mr. Elman Norton. Okay, oh, I put him in the vampire town. I did, I forgot about that. Okay, so let me reacquaint myself with this absolute mess. Okay, yes, yes, I remember I imprisoned a lady outside. Yes, that's right. I starved her to death, yes, um, so that the Grim Reaper would come to my lot and I could add the Grim Reaper to my family, which I have done. Don't really know how that's going to pan out. But yes, and then also, not to be forgotten, I have my prison roommates, my roommates back here in this little dungeon apartment. Apartment. Uh, oh yeah, they had children. Hi, Zeke. Hi, I was just talking about you. Yes, I was, darling. Oh, good stretch. Oh, really good stretch. Well done. What was I saying? Yes, they had twins. I forgot that they had twins. They had twin babies. And wait, why have I got this? Oh, did I hire a butler? I think I... Yes, that's the butler there. I wondered who you were. What was your name? Butler H. L. Fassi. You know what? I I don't mind what your name is as long as I don't have to clean any of the dishes. I do enough of that in real life. Okay, so let's play. So I kind of want to start some kind of relationship with the Grim Reaper. So let's see what we can do. Ooh, ask if single. Why not? Why is he throwing confetti? Is he happy because someone died? I mean, understandable, but Grim Reaper has learned that Elmer is single. <laughs> Yay! Ask her a scare question. Did my butler just fart? I think my butler just farted. Damn it, butler. Now you're gonna have to air freshen the room. Exchange numbers. Well, you already live here, so stop reading and come here and romance me. Do these options not get any, like, better? Because I want to, like, marry him and have a family with him. But it's just gonna be the same options. Broken. Something's broken. Oh, the bed is broken. Ooh, do I want to fix it or shall I just see where it goes? I'll see where it goes. I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay. So, I don't know. Like, I can give him a romantic gift. You can have my trash pile! Yeah! Hey! I hope he likes it. I think he likes it. He did like it! Yay! He likes my trash! That means we stand a chance. Oh, there's more things. Okay, cool. Oh, there's a baby cry- Why are you crying? Why? I have no time for you. Parents? Go and fix that baby. I'm trying to romance the Grim Reaper. Well, you know what? If it won't let me- marry him the old-fashioned way, then I guess I could just go into the create a sim mode and marry them on there. Okay, modifying create a sim. I should be able to change our relationships. Wait a minute, vampire? When did I make him a vampire? I don't remember that at all. I wonder why I never remember what it is I do when I play these games. It's a mystery, I swear. Okay, can I change? What? Why can't I do that? No, I don't think I did it right. Okay, bear with me. No, mummy's doing something very important. No, I am, I swear. Aha, now I can make I can make him my brother, husband, or son. I mean, son would be fun, but we've already been flirting with him, so that's out. So husband it is. Oh, I need to give him a first name. Why do I need to give him a first name? His name's Grim Reaper. Grim 
Who wants to change his surname to Norton? Yeah, you know what? Grim Norton. Why not? Grim Norton. Okay, now I wonder if if we go somewhere that, for example, had some kind of a wedding arch, we could renew our vows and it would look like a nice wedding. Maybe we could do that. So where is likely to have a wedding arch? Willow Creek, do you have a wedding arch? Mm, Magnolia Blossom Park. Mm, nice. Newcrest. Oh, okay. Well, there's nothing there. That's nice. Windenburg. Windenburg, you got anything? The Bluffs. I'm sure I could put some kind of an arch there, it'd be fine. I can't have him travel with me. What's the point of even having a Grim Reaper husband if I can't do anything with him? Okay, now come on. Jesus, people think it's easy just sitting here playing The Sims, but it's not. It's really, really difficult. Okay, so it's too bright in here and I can't see a thing. So, like, I don't really want to change anything. I just want to add a wedding arch to this lovely landscape. Okay, what about here? Okay, now can you guys go over here and renew your vow? House. <gasps> Amazing! It'll be just like a wedding! Okay, come on you guys. Where are you? Come on. Oh my god. It's so beautiful! <gasps> oh! Oh. oh my god, they make Blue such Saber. a cute couple, you guys. Oh my god, Elmer plus Grim forever. <laughs> you can have your married sims move in together or buy... Ah, uh, yeah. What, see, the thing is... Pause. The thing is, they've just started their newlywed life together. They're gonna wanna have a baby. Now, I know they can't have babies because unfortunately, science has not invented magic yet in which a man and a man can have a baby. However, I can adopt a baby, but I'm thinking, mm, I've already got two prisoners, roommates, and they already have two children, which I don't really care for. They were just kind of an experiment because I was bored. So maybe we should move out, get a place for our own, adopt a kid, get some kind of dog or cat or both and start a new life together. I think that's what we need to do. All right, okie dokie. Come on you lovebirds, time to get home. We want to move houses. So move household. Oh wait, was that the right one? Mm, I don't think that was the right one. Split household and move, that's what we want to do. Go on Grim, call the real estate agent. Okay, so who do I want to move? I want to move out Grim and Norton and leave the others where they are oh hold on no i haven't unlocked the doors that let them out of their prison should i go back and unlock the doors no they'll be fine okay how much how much money would i like to transfer all of it please okay so i have nine grand where can i move with nine grand not many places um can i afford anywhere that's not just a piece of land no Right, well, I guess I'm probably going to have to move into the city then and rent an apartment. Oh, this one's historical and haunted. This one has gremlins. Oh, that's already got people in it. And that needs TLC. Meh. What about this one? Okay. This one is quiet and haunted. This one is already taken. This one has gnomes and... There's too many things there. We just need two bedrooms. Okay, let's go for this one, the quiet and haunted. That'll be fun. Do I want it furnished? Um, uh, no, unfurnished, please. We only want to buy the essentials. Hi, Bowie. Hi, darling. You're so beautiful. Mummy loves you. Oh, good wash. Well done. Yes. Yes. Good boy. Okay. So, let's have a look at our new home. Wait, which one's ours? I don't know. Which one is ours, darling? Hello. Which house? Oh, that house. Okay. The empty one. Perfect. So, okay. We have just, we have about eight and a half grand to decorate all this house. So what shall we do with it? It's kind of hard to see because it's so bright in here. Stupid sunlight. Maybe if I put some lights in here. Oh, okay. Well, that did nothing. Okay. So I went away for a while. I had another beer because I had to wait for the sun to get a bit lower so that I could actually see my computer screen because today the sun decided today was going to be the one day a year that it shines in Dublin so so I have come back I had got myself a new beer because I finished the last one and now we are going to decorate Elmer and Grimm's new apartment so and we're gonna need a kids room because I am expecting a baby so okay so where's the door the doors there we have a hallway then we have this little room this big area here we have an area here and here so I'm thinking kitchen living room area here bathroom here a main bedroom and a kids bedroom what do we think I think that's a good idea okie dokie so bathroom right I've got to keep it within the budget so it's the cheapest 
of the cheap. Kitchen and living room, what is the cheapest? This one is. I love that these kids' ceiling lights are the absolute cheapest. Okay, what is the cheapest living room? Oh, okay, this is very depressing. Done. Ooh, a nice sofa here, little table here with a stereo. Oh my god, whenever you get a sim, a stereo, they just keep it on like 24 seven. They have a problem. I don't wanna get that plant, I wanna get a little TV. What is the cheapest TV I can find? Perfect. Okay, we have some extra space over here. So I'm thinking we should get some little bits and bobs for our cat that we're gonna have. Okay, so this is the kitty station. So the kitty is gonna have this little thing, whatever that is, and then, I don't know, uh, a nice toy box. Ooh, fancy. And then, oh, over here we'll have the kitty's food bowl. Mm -hmm. Very nice, very nice. And what else is the cat? <gasps> Litter tray. Aha. Yes, I knew there was another thing cats needed. Okay, I'm gonna get this like self cleaning one that's really expensive, but I know my sim is not gonna clean out the litter tray, so I mean, okay. Now it is time for the master bedroom. Ah, this looks nice and cheap. Ooh, pink, okay. There isn't very much furniture in this bedroom. They don't even give you an option really, like this is all they have. Bedroom, we have just under three grand left, so we are gonna need Am I adopting a baby or a child? I'll see what's on offer. Okay, Alma, time for you, my dear, to adopt a baby. Make a loan payment. Why am I in debt? I, I, did I send him to university? I probably did. Am I still at university? <laughs> I am, but I have done absolutely nothing. Good to know. Just like real university. Hire a service because adopting a child is a service. Ooh, okay. Adopt a child. No cost. <gasps> what? I thought they charged you for that. Oh, they have so many babies. Oh, and okay. They have babies. They have toddlers and they have children. So do I want a baby? Uh, sure. Why not? So which baby? Uh, well, oh, oh no. <laughs> I was gonna say that one because his name's Alien, but it's not as Alan. Close enough. Okay, so uh, Elma's off to get the baby, and Grim is on the sofa watching the Penguin TV. Good. Oh, oh, I can change his name. Okay, okay. I don't know if this baby's a boy or a girl, so we shall call him. I think we should go back to what my original thought was when I saw his name. I thought he said Alien, so let's call him Alien Norton. Why not? Elma Norton is bringing home a new family member. Oh, and also I have a, okay, I have an achievement. Hello darkness, my old chum. Have a friend befriend, have a sim befriend the Grim Reaper. Well, I should hope so. We're married and we have a child. I should hope that we're friends. Okay. Oh, I can now take family leave. Oh, my baby just appeared there as if by magic. Oh, stupid wardrobe. Wow, look at that baby. I don't know if you're a boy or a girl. I guess we'll see. I mean, you can choose. You be you. Okay, so now I need some some kind of baby room. So they already gave me a bed for the baby, like a crib, so that's nice of them. But now I need the other things. So what things does a baby need? Okay, apparently babies need a really giant fucking giraffe. Okay, I'll just put that next to its bed so it feels like it's got a friend. Uh, apparently they also need a little dinosaur mat, sure. Uh, a dresser, because babies are the height of fashion. Uh, yeah, sure. And a bookshelf, because they can 100% read. I mean, oh, <laughs> yay. Wow. Oh, the baby's screaming already. Okay, I want to see how grim in with the baby. So, uh, Bottle feed. I don't know what you want. Um, a cuddle. What baby would not be comforted by the warm embrace of death? Oh, you know what? He's not doing the worst job ever. He's all talk. He pretends to be this tough guy and he's not. <gasps> Grim has reached parenting level one. Oh, I knew he would do a good job. Ah, uh, Norton, what are you doing? Elmer, you are in the bar. Are you a celeb? You're a global superstar. When did I do that? I don't even remember that. Oh, he's very thirsty. Oh, okay. Um, can you eat your baby? Not eat your baby, but just like drink from your baby. No, can you drink from Grim? Mm, the Grim Reaper does not possess any plasma. Mm. Um, do we have any neighbors? No. No, okay, maybe we can invite someone over. This is why I imprisoned those people. So that I could drink from them. Stupid. Okay, well, I guess I'll just invite someone over then. Okay, Serena, apparently my professor. I'll invite her over. She'll be right over. Idiot. 
Okay, oh, here she is. Okay, so hello, Serena. So, uh, don't mind me, I'm just going to um, drink your blood. He's so casual as he goes up to her as well. Wow, amazing parent. Grim, I think you should get a job. I don't think you have a job, do you? Do you have a job? No, you don't. Okay, Grim, I think you need to find a job. Find your dream job. Oh, my baby's crying again. Okay, Grim, what do you want to do? Do you want... Oh, look at all these choices. Oh. Okay, well, I've got to do actor. I mean, Grim has to be an actor. He just has to be. Okay, Grim, you are now going to be an actor. Alma, do you even have a job or not? Oh, you do. You're a petty thief. Good for you. Okay, your baby is still crying, though. So, um... Oh, it's stinky. Well, make it unstinky, then. Perfect. Okay, Grim, what do you need to do if you're acting career? Oh, we need to find a gig first. Okay, well, let's find something to do. Um, AI staffing agency or everyday extras talent agent. That one looks more friendly. Okay. Yay! Okay, so I need to find an audition. Okay, the Vladislas hardware, the preclinical pharmaceuticals, the making music, or the salty studs commercial. Mm hmm. I'm gonna go for Salty Studs commercial. Charisma level two is needed. What is his charisma level? Let's see. Level one. Okay, we can work with that. That's fine. Um. Oh, I need a mirror to work on that. Okay, I'll buy a mirror. Grim, I'm gonna make you the next Clint Eastwood. Hello, Elmer. We're searching for a celebrity partner to promote the Prim Sim Cosmetics Company. Um, use the video station to record. Huh, I don't know if I can afford that, but let's see. If not, I can just sell some of my baby's things. It doesn't even need that much. It's a baby. <gasps> I can't afford it. Oh, I'm like 300 quid short. Okay, baby, time for me to sell your things so I can further my career. Perfect. Okay. And you know what? I'll put the video station in your room so we can share it. Perfect. Okay. Oh, I can't afford the chair now. How much is the chair? 300 quid. Okay. How much is that rug I got you? 56 quid. Okay. Um, what about the giraffe? 160. Can I afford it yet? No. Okay. Get rid of that rug. Can I afford it? <gasps> yes. Okay. I better make some serious money from this video, whatever it is I'm making. Emma, you have to record a video. Uh, beauty tips video, I think. Was it? Yes. Yes. It was. Oh no, beauty product review. That's what I had to do. Okay. Oh, there are people outside. Grim, let them in. Friendly introduction, why not? Okay, he ran off, probably because you bring death with you wherever you go. What about this guy, paparazzi? Oh no, don't talk to him, he's not very nice. Who are you? Oh, you're the lady that I, uh, I, uh, I, I ate. Okay. Well, oh, we have bills already? Oh no. Where are Grim? Grim. Okay, you do you. Um, oh, look at him, look at him go. Oh my god, he's amazing. Look at him go, wait, Grim, you're there. Okay, what was in the mailbox? Uh, some kind of potion. Cool. And, oh, trash, oh no, that's the trash pole that we gave him so he would fall in love with us. Oh, there's more people here. Oh, Annie's holding cake. Oh, can we invite him in? Agree to hang out. Yes. School spirit day. Okay, university, do you really think that I am ever coming back? No, in fact, should we just drop out now? Let's just drop out now. Okay. Um, drop out of university. Perfect. Wow, this video must be amazing. What is he reviewing? It looks like a face cream, some eyeshadow palettes, and some... Grim, you making friends, hun? Yeah, he's making friends. Invite neighbors in. Oh, okay. What do I want to call this video? Beauty review video. Um, what's a nice clickbait title? Oh, I know. Top 10 things to make you less ugly. I bet, I bet you'll never guess what they are. Perfect. Okay, do I want to edit it? Um, no, I'll just upload it. I'm sure that'd be fine. Do I really want to drop out? Yes, I do. Wait, is Grim uploading your video? Okay. Oh, Grim, that's what you were meant to be doing. You're meant to be getting your charisma skill. Duh. Go on. Go talk to yourself for a little bit. Apparently, it gives you life skills. I talk to myself all the time. <laughs> I have no life skills. Stop kissing in my apartment. I frown upon that for some reason. I hope you like the cake. It's an heirloom. Okay. Do I like the cake? Is he liking it? I mean, is fruit delicacy very nice i just want to like fast forward now to like grim's freaking audition okay first off i'm gonna hire a nanny because i know that i'm gonna forget about this kid maybe you should hire a butler and just put the butler's bed in with the baby <gasps> oh that's an idea Okay, but I'll do it later because I've only got 75, I've only got 75 simoleons. Mm -hmm. Grim, do you have a reflection? Oh, you do, thank God. Okay, you're not a vampire. If there were two vampires in the house, that would be crazy. <laughs> oh, hi there. My name is Nanny Lacey. Nice to meet you. I am sensibly sufficient in every way. Oh, okay. 
An acquaintance was telling me how much they dislike you. Try being a little nicer. The incoming dislike is a slippery slope. <laughs> I really don't give a shit. Grim, are you skilled enough yet? Yes, you are. Amazing. Is there something about doing odd jobs? What are odd jobs? What can I do with them? Mayhem at the beach. I don't need skills for that. I need skills for most of these. Oh, no skill needed. Perfect. Haha. -ha. <laughs> Finally, something for me. Okay, I'll go do that. Elmer, I think you should do something as well. Just leave the people in your house. I'm sure they'll be fine. They've, they've got a nanny to take care of them. Find something to do. Okay, is there anything else that requires no skill? Uh, okay, other things require skill. Um, I'll just go for Wingman Wanted. And um, hopefully Elmer's charm will do the trick. Right, when are you guys going to... Starts at 3 p.m. Starts at 3 p.m. Well, you want to hurry up there, guys. Come on. I want some money. Wait a minute. Who made grilled cheese? We have no money. We can't afford food. What do you mean you can't go anywhere? Yes, you can. Go to work. And you, go to work. Go on. Okay. Now it's time to spy on the nanny to see if she does a good job. Well, my child is asleep and you're just staring at it, so that's creepy. Oh, okay. Oh, those people enjoyed hanging out at my house even though I left them here alone with my nanny and my baby. Good. Oh, that one's still here. Oh, okay. Why is my nanny watching TV? You should be watching my baby as it sleeps. How unprofessional of you. Oh, ponytail's going home. Okay, bye dude. Okay, so the Grim Reaper is about to go off to his audition any minute now. And Elmer is at work, working hard as a petty thief. And our baby, Alien, is still being stared at by the creepy nanny. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Oh my god, Grim. Look at those moves. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, he got shy and knew we were looking at him. Now he's just two-stepping it. Go on, Grim. Go on. Show him what you got, babe. Yes, queen. Go on. Looks like our time today has concluded. See you later. No, you don't. I'm just going to call you right back again. I don't want to take care of my own children. Absolutely not. Oh, I didn't adopt a pet. I got all this stuff for pets and I didn't buy a pet. How stupid of me. Let's get one now. I would like one pet, please. I want a cat. Oh. Wait. Did you even... You didn't even pick one. Damn it, Grim. He said, I want a cat. Grim, why won't you adopt a cat? Do you do not like them? Come on, third time. Lucky, Grim. I want you to adopt a cat. Why isn't it working? Okay, you know what? I'll wait till Elmer gets home. Then I'll do it myself. Why is my baby crying? Why is my nanny not doing anything? Okay, there we go. Grim, oh my god, there's food everywhere. Will you just clean up all this mess, please? And thank you. Good god. I don't even have a bookshelf, so where did that book come from? I don't think Grim's bars ever lower. Like... Elmer's does, but Grimm's just don't seem to lower, ever, so good. I don't have to take care of him. I don't want to play Sims to take care of people, I want to play Sims to do stupid stuff. Uh. Oh my goodness, Elmer has been Elmer has been promoted to ringleader. <gasps> Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. He got 558 simoleons and a duffel of cash and a pickpocket interaction. I, c I can now afford a bed for my butler, okay. Perfect. Right, I'm gonna sell that. Am I gonna sell that duffel bag? Yes, that's got money coming out of it. That's very suspicious. So I'll get rid of that. Um, bed. What's the cheapest bed I can buy? That one's for kids. Is this one for grown ups? Yes. Perfect. I'll put it. Uh, I put it over here so we can all have a bit of privacy. You know, we've got the work area. We've got the uh, baby's area, and now we've got the butler's bed. Okay, Elma. Honey, I need you to hire a service and I need you to get a butler. And also, I want to adopt a damn cat. <gasps> okay, now I'm going to pick them based off the name alone. So, we have Cashew, Angel, Clover, Bronco, Smokey, Milo, Munka, Spatula, Whopper, and Apollo. I'm going to pick Clover because when we adopted Ziggy, that was the name that the shelter had given him. And I was like, I'm that, no, he's not going to be called Clover. That's no. But uh, this little kitten is called Clover. So that makes me think of Zig. So we're going to get that. Hee <laughs> hee, so exciting. Is this lady that's bringing me my cat? Did she forget the cat? Where is it? Hello. Oh, it's over here. It appeared. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my God, look at it. It's so cute. Ooh. Oh, wait, where'd you go, kitty? Where'd you go? I want to adopt you. Okay. <gasps> Oh my goodness, go on Elmer, 
Go get your kitty. Are you sure you want to adopt this pet? More sure than I've ever been of anything in my life. And I have adopted a child. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I want to be friends with it. Give it a treat. That's how you make friends with people. You give them stuff. Oh, my kitty cat is friends with me. Okay, when's my butler going to get here? A sign bed to... What? Where is my butler? Stupid butler. Pet obsessions. What's my pet obsessed with? The bathtub? That's strange. Okay. You know, oh my god, look at how he runs. <gasps> she runs, I think it's a girl. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, my heart. <laughs> okay. You know what? It's strange that the Grim Reaper, well, actually, no, it's not strange. It's perfectly normal that the Grim Reaper can't woohoo with anyone. So I feel like if uh, if Elma has any needs that need to be fulfilled, they're going to have to be fulfilled by other people. Speaking of which, I want to drink your blood. Just a little drink, though, because you are taking care of my child. Come on, Elma. Oh, right in front of the baby as well. This is gonna scar him for life. Him, her. I still don't know what my baby is. Being a parent is so hard. Okay. Oh, Elmo, you're stinky, hun. Go, sh go, take a bath. Grim, almost Alien's birthday. Is it? I swear, I only just got her yesterday. Oh, Grim wants to be friends with the kitten. Cute. Okay. Who was that? Oh, it's my butler. Amazing. This is your bed in here, you lucky devil. Samira Horta, I think that said. Ah, oh, Grim. Oh, you make such a good cat dad. This butler has nothing to do. Like, this place is so small and there's hardly any furniture to keep, like, clean and tidy. But I just want a butler. Makes me feel fancy. Wish I had a butler in real life. Oh, I just well, want to go to Grimm's acting. Ah, come on. What will I do to pass the time? I don't know. Grimm's audition starts in an hour. <gasps> Wait a minute, whoa, whoa, wait. Miko Ojo, that was the lady that I imprisoned in that house and then left there. Hey, I heard you became friends with Jacqueline Lacey. First off, how would you know that? You're meant to be stuck in my old house. And secondly, who is Jacqueline Lacey? I don't think I'm friends with her because I don't I don't know that. Is that my is that my nanny? It might be my nanny. But still, you should know that. You should be stuck in your little prison. Okay, Grim. Now, just be calm, be yourself, be natural, and they'll love you. All right? Just relax. Okay. What are you doing? Watching the TV? Don't do that. You're meant to be at work. Oh my god, he's going. Okay. At an audition. Why is this board flashing at me? Read about a festival. Okay. Come on, stop watching telly. Let's read. Oh, the flea market. Yes, I think we will go. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, what's that say? I think it said I passed my audition. Oh, ooh, ooh, I'm so excited. He did. He passed his audition. Amazing. Okay, so Grim, what have you got to do for your actual act? Develop acting skill, develop charisma skill. I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay, flea market. So what is there to buy at this flea market? Because I have 1,000 smackaroonies to just... So far, it's just a lot of chairs. Doesn't look particularly interesting. Oh, there's a man playing a guitar. <gasps> yeah, let's go watch. Watch performance. Amazing. Let's go. Wow. He is... Oh, wait, you're burning. <gasps> you're a vampire. Of course you are. You can't go outside. Quick, go back inside. Go on. Go, Alma. Go. You're going to burn to death. Why didn't I think of that? Why didn't it occur to me that vampires can't go outside in the daylight? Grim, when is your... 12 p.m. on Monday. Okay, let's just whiz through this day then and get to that. Why is my baby sad? What do you want now? Well, it certainly doesn't want Elma screaming at it. For God's sake. Is it... Oh, it's stinky. Okay. I haven't seen my kitten in a while. Hope it's alive. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh my Grim's just telling the butler all about his acting gear. He's uh, so excited. Oh, little dance party. Why not? Is the butler... No, the butler's not going to do any work. She's just going to read a book. Okay, sure. I mean, I'm not paying you, so do what you want. Ah, oh, Grim's giving the kitten a cuddle. Miko Ojo, I heard the scoop. There's some crazy parties happening at the bluffs right now. Want to check it out? You're not allowed to leave the house. I locked you in there. No. Wait. <gasps> Wait a minute, is that a ghost? Oh yeah, this house is haunted. <gasps> Who are you? Oh, I like you. Can I flirt with you? Oh, Let's yeah. see, friendly introduction, why not? I can hear a cat snoring somewhere, but I can't see them. Oh, I can. Aha! Oh, but Grim's are right there, best not. Okay, best not while my husband's there. <gasps> He's possessing my bin. Oh shit. Oh, why is Grim scared of a ghost? You, you, you're the one that killed him. He's pretty snazzy looking. What's his name? Felix Side, 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 sided, Felix sided, 
Okay, I'm I'm gonna stop. Ah, oh, nice friendly hug. Oh, Felix wants to join in. It's okay. There's room in this relationship for another guy. More the merrier, right? Oh, okay. It kind of looks like Elmer's giving uh, Grim a little lap dance there. <laughs> Grim was like, no, no, no. <laughs> I like you, but I don't I don't want to see you like that. Startled by a ghost. You really needn't be. Okay, Grim, you're gonna have to go to work soon, okay? You can't just sit around watching the TV, petting the cat all day. Today's mail has been delivered. Oh, I hope it wasn't Bills. Was it Bills? Yep, Bills. A grand? That literally only leaves me with 77 quid. Fine. Grim, are you going to your... Grim, you Grim, you... You have to go to your audition. Are you going to go to your audition? Really? After all that, he's not going to go to his audition? Why? Why are you not going to go? It's because you're not prepared. You don't have to be prepared. You just have to show up. Right. <sighs> right. Well, I guess we're going to leave it there then because Grim is refusing to go to his audition that I spent ages trying to get and ages sitting here waiting for time to pass so we could do that together. But he's not going to go. So on that note, I'm going to go. <sighs> Thank you for watching. I know The Sims videos aren't for all of you, but there is a niche group of you that really likes them, and uh, this is for you, my dears. Also, one of my oldest and dearest friends, Beth, uh, she absolutely adores whenever I play The Sims. <laughs> um, so this is for you, Beth. I love you. Thank you to Anne Winter, Annie, Chris, JDT, Noel Purcell, Rachel Fox, Sarah Dark, Taylor Hutchinson, Tilly and Xeno Skulls Gaming. Thank you so much for becoming a patron. Thank you so much for believing in me. New patrons, your thank you cards are in the post, so keep an eye out for them. And on that note, I just want to say thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching. I had fun. Hopefully you had fun. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Stay indoors. Stay safe. Love you guys.